All right, thanks, Andy. It's time for another news. We take a look at the news stories that may not be on your radar, but certainly should be. While driving up 14th Street Northwest, a DC ambulance played the sirens from the movie The Purge. You remember that, the movie franchise where once a year people get a 12-hour window where all crimes are legal. Hey, EMT still have a sense of humor, and naturally it's a dark one. Now, if you saw any of the Purge films, you know this is reason number 10,000 to stay in the house. It's actually reason number one through 10,000 to stay in the house. I wouldn't get in any ambulance playing this music. I'd take my chances at home rather than take that ride. This ambulance is about to have people looking at WebMD to fix broken legs and gunshot wounds. In other news, two Missouri apartment dwellers got creative about social distancing by building a pulley system from their second floor window to get their pizza from a delivery driver. They you see it right there. It looks like a trap that Wally Coyote was set up for the Roadrunner, but it worked and they kept things safe and entertaining. Reeling everything up looks like a good little exercise as well. This is the kind of ingenuity we need on the front lines of this crisis. In other news, an Indian Forest Service officer shared video footage of a lion openly roaming through city streets at night. If folks need any more reason to self-quarantine, here it is. This is in India. If you go out during the day, you get caned by police. If you go out at night, lions. Pick your poison or just stay home. And finally, back home, busboys and poets owner, and owner Andy Shalal is paying artists to create uplifting murals on the exteriors of closed restaurants throughout the city. I have no jokes about this. I just want to highlight it. This is simply incredible. I tip my cap to Andy as well as all those artists that have lended a hand. Now let me know what you think of these stories using the hashtag GetUpDC. Right now, let's turn it over to Howard.